Hey YouTube, this is PC Wizard here, and I'm doing this video because of um, comments that I see all the time. Um, today we're going to show you how to create a World of Warcraft account. And on that note, I will also be making a video. Well, I've made it. I just got to do some final touches on it on the video um, on how to put Snow Leopard on your PC. I haven't find out how to dual boot them on the same hard drive yet, but that won't be too far away, okay? Now, for today, we're going to show you how to create a World of Warcraft account. First, you, you can even do it two ways. Once you've installed the game, you need to go to your Internet Explorer, which is, I use Firefox, and go to worldofwarcraft.com, which will take you to the community site. Uh, yeah, the death of the Lich King is finally come at hand, the final new dungeon for Lich King, but the new expansion that's coming will be continue the chapter, you, you know, continue the game. Now, to create a new uh, account, once you've got your, your um, World of Warcraft installed, you go to create a, an account, Do you have a Battle.net account? Well, if you do, click yes. If you don't, you have to create one. Do -do 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 -do. Select your country and, well, just follow this. I'll do it. Uh, I'll just get you to the point where I can't go any further because I've already made one. Because you're only allowed to have one Battle.net account. And just scroll it down. And click I accept. Get, put in a name, your email address. See, this is why I can't create one, show you how to create one completely. Because it's locked to your email address. Choose a circuit question. And an answer, and hopefully you can read. Just type type that in the box here, and hit continue. Now, um, I'll go back, and once you've filled out, it will take you to this page, obviously. Well, once you log in. with your new Battle.net account. You enter your key. And then you click Add Game. And once you've added that, it will take you to a uh, subscription or, or it will ask you for payment. Now, you, you can either, um, it will give you you can either pay by credit card and have a subscription, or you can pay by prepaid cards, which you can purchase from EB Games or another game shop that sells them. Um, once you've done that, your your account is ready to start. But, but by the way, once you've bought the game, it comes with a free month of play gameplay, so you can have you get a free your first month free. Or if you're a newbie and you're not sure and you haven't bought the game yet, you can click here. Try the World of Warcraft for free for 10 days. And, and once you put in your payment details and then you're set, you just log in with your email address, your Battle.net account, your email address and password, which is your Battle.net account. So in the password be the password to your Battle.net account. And you should be logged in. Now, if you're unsure, once you've um, done that, if you're unsure to sign in, um, I'll just pause this for a sec, so it will give me the first time play. Okay, I'm back. I just had to delete a few files, so it would give me the first time play. Now, your World of Warcraft will be in here, but I put mine in the games folder. Qu quick and easy to quick and easy to do. 
and you should what will happen is if you haven't got the up-to-date um, version of the game it will probably start download downloading but um, downloading the updates but what I find is um, you don't get good enough speed when you're downloading from Blizzard themselves so I will provide a link in the more more info section um, where you can download where you can download um, patches from different mirrors you, there's a lot like different places where you can download the same patch and you can't just download the latest one like version 3.3 .3. you gotta go to version 3.2.1 because that's where it starts off. Well, I'll show you what I mean in a sec. Okay. Um, let's start the game. Once you hit play, once you've downloaded the updates, it'll take you into the game. You'll get the welcome video, but I'm just going to get past this. Uh, I'm not sure if my software allows this view what's happening in full screen mode, so I'm going to turn it into window mode for a sec. Okay, I wasn't sure if this program I'm using supports um, full screen mode, so it's recorded. It. So you don't have to worry about window mode, it's so you can see what's happening. Now, you'll get the welcome screen. Now you may want to go into video settings and change it. Change it to ultra to get the best quality. Depending on your graphics card of course, you, I suggest you have at least a 8500 to, if you want to go in high, the best, res, the best resolution and the best effects. Any lower than that then I wouldn't recommend it just leave it at the default settings or just change a few video settings and once you've done that sign in with your Valnet account now I have, I have multiple accounts linked to this here you'll get to choose your realm this is another thing people are saying well what do I do once I've done logged in. Okay. Now I suggest if you live in the suggest you look you select your region. Don't if you're not a United States person then don't go to the United States. Select your where your country is. This is for Australians. Most of Australians are signed in the, in this realm. Um what realm style realm style, sorry is normal where they can't attack you, other players can't attack you unless you challenge them or they challenge you or you can challenge real play which allows you to force on a player combat while always you're at risk of being attacked by someone. Real play is have a striking name conversation and behavior rules for player in interested in uh -huh. in okay and this basically involves does both this and that together of the you know for a beginner, I'll just select normal. Now, it's automatic, it automatically tries to assign you one, but if you don't like that one and you want to see all the other different lists, you can click view lists. Now, the population means how, <laughs> well, obviously, how much populated. If if it's full like this, you won't be able to log in. It'll, it'll put you on a, in a queue, and you have to wait until it, it, you until you um, move up the queue and log, can log in. I suggest you not do that. Now, new players, which means it's a new realm. It's just been created, so there'll be new new beginners like yourselves 
mostly in the 